So this is the massive gate. It's extending off the side there. Prevents cut through. I was just on the other side. So to get here, you have to go up 280, cross Cherokee, and come back down on Smire. Today I wanted to video Smire. Special roads on my all my commutes, just about all my commutes. But it's also when I moved back to Alabama and started to get back into racing, or really even before starting into racing, I used to time myself on this climb, you know, before Strava, before I had a GPS. I would time myself, and I had a backpack time and a non-backpack time, you know, based on whether it was a commute or not, and uh, so it's just, just special that way, I guess, but it's a beautiful climb. Heavily wooded, they call this Cherokee Forest on all the maps. Uh, little creek right here, so in the middle of a downpour, that's full. And uh, just nice, gradual climb. You can tell this road has some history, though. There's a speed bump that's been here the whole time I've been here that I know about. I'm not sure when it was put. There's a speed bump. So they must have had problems with people going crazy fast. I know I would if, if there's no speed bump here. I'd come flying around this corner. But that just adds to the nature of the climb. There's this one little spot right there where it's been gouged out a little bit, smoothed over. Sort of use that as a ramp to uh, bump, bunny hop over it. And the, the sound is the big giant fans at the Brooklyn Mall. So we're climbing, climbing back behind the mall here. See that structure down there is the mall. The topography here is really right, right through here. It's just, it's not, I mean, the topography is cool, but it's not so to that as the, uh, They've just built buildings right into the cliff. So the hospital where Josiah was born. There's a parking deck where two parking, two different parking decks that are both in the cliff. You can see the rocks and everything. It's kind of cool. And then there's a big creek. Shades, Shades Creek runs through the valley. And it floods. So all the buildings along the creek are on stilts. Just kind of cool to see an office building on stilts. And uh, this is the Brooklyn Metroplex cut through. So you don't want to fool with 280, you can cut through there to get over here. It's more the principle than anything else that they uh, block that off. I, mean, I guess they have every legal right to, but they're definitely on my blacklist. Won't ever be doing business with Morgan Keegan, even though it's really not their fault either. But they do lease that building. An official Smire segment, the short one starts like right here where this tree is. You, big chain ring all the way up, 18, 19 miles an hour. This is what I filmed yesterday, but I'm going to go ahead and film the rest of the Smire climb so I can have the entire climb on one video. Just four, five percent. It just went from four and a half to five. Five percent through here. 4.7. Couple hundred watts. And 3924 today. Some super steep driveways. That one and this next one. Oh, that guy just pulled out from the driveway. How cool. That guy just pulled out from this driveway. Super steep. I've always wanted to go up it. Hey, maybe that means I can go up it right now. 
Anyway, I'm not going to do that. This is one of the steeper sections right through here. Not very steep. I think it kicks up to seven somewhere in here. I'm still only showing six. Yeah. Yeah, maybe maybe it doesn't get up to seven, six, I guess. And then you come through here, or maybe it depends on how fast you're going, the reading that you get. Um, so you're coming through here, this is a, oh yeah, so yeah, this, it kicks up a little bit right there, but I consider this the flat part, because it flattens out right here, and you have to be going super fast through here. I'm trying to get the KOM. Oh, right here in this corner, what we just passed there, we just passed on the, the right. It's still pretty cool because the bushes and everything uh, come right up to the road, but they used to have a whole thing of oak leaf hydrangeas, which were just absolutely beautiful, uh, big, giant oak leaves, and uh, out into the road. <laughs> so it was really cool. Well, apparently, Vestavi or Mountain Brook, whoever owns this property, this land, this road, didn't like that, trimmed it back. And then uh, every year, every, I, mean, I always look for them though, because they, the seeds and everything, you can always find them. It's not like they used to be though. You, you, were, you were like, at, when you're bent over going fast, you were, eye level with the flowers so the uh, it just gave a, a sensation of going extremely fast and it was kind of cool looking it's the hurricane Ivan landslide again coming up towards the end of the, the short Smire segment. Yeah, when I set the KOM on that one, I was planning on you know, going, going to beat my record time on the long version too. <laughs> I could not pedal. When I got up here to the top, I had given it everything. Couldn't pedal, couldn't keep on going. So, uh, But I'm gonna take you up to the, the long, the long KOM finish. Um, and that's what I used to originally time. And I used to tell everybody the uh, one of the great things about this climb is this section right here. You've got a lot going on. You gotta check, make sure nobody's coming up the hill. Or if they are, you have to gun it to get in front of them or you have to back off a little bit to get behind them. And, uh, but anyway, it takes your mind off of the pain. So the pain in your legs, you get a little reprieve from that and usually a little shot of adrenaline that will uh, get you up through here and help you push harder than you could normally. Get up this little thing right here. What do we got? Eight and a half percent. So get up that. And then, uh, you know, ideally carry your momentum through it. This is relatively flat, three to four percent the rest of the way. Watch out for that pothole. Been there forever. Go to the middle. And then it doesn't really matter through here.
pretty views. You can see the double oak way ridge lines are all that way. Several of them stacked. I've always said if this, this would be the, the one house I'd want to get though. Right there. Beautiful view, small. Just overlooking all those ridges. Probably see 10 different ridges. You know, most of them are small ridge lines, but the main ones and then smaller ridges coming off the Cabo River. Amazing view. And that's just from getting a tiny little glimpse of it on my rides. And this right here is the top of the Smyre climb. My record on it's like six, 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 ten, uh, you know, 12, 11, 12, somewhere in there. Uh, today, I'd guess 10 minutes, maybe nine. All right, that's it. Oh, I'm filming it, 11 minutes and 15 seconds. <laughs>